Amit, congratulations. Two days and two world teams. Um, that's pretty impressive. How are you feeling after, after making the cadet world team, just one day after making the junior world team? I'm feeling super happy. This is something I've wanted to do ever since I was little, and it's so cool to have finally gotten a chance to do it. Uh, I felt really good competing after you know COVID and quarantine, so yeah, I'm just really happy to be here. Something you wanted to do ever since you were little. When was the first time that, that you had wrestling goals, that you knew you really wanted to win on a, on a world stage? You know, I remember when I was 10, uh, watching the Olympics, I was like, you know, I want to be there one day. I want to go to the Olympics. And since then, it's been a dream, you know, as long as I can remember. I even remember when they got rid of wrestling for the Olympics, I was so sad, and then they brought it back. And yeah, so pretty much my whole life, I, that's been a dream. That's amazing. And you've taken, I mean, massive steps forward this weekend. I think a lot of people knew you, you were very capable of, of making these world teams, but now you've gotten it done. Does it feel different knowing, all right, now you're on the team for Budapest, you're on the team for UFA Russia. Does it feel different knowing, all right, you got that done? Uh, yeah, it feels different. I feel like now I have a bigger, uh, harder goal to work on. I have a lot of training to do and preparation for both worlds this summer. Uh, yeah, it's, it feels real. Instead of like a plan, it feels like now it's happening. In, in your best two out of three finals tonight, I think I think you wrestled less than a minute, maybe something like forty seconds combined. Very dominant. Um, was that part of the plan, or or did just a byproduct of the work that you put in? You know, I think it's a byproduct. I just work as hard as I can to be the best that I can, and if that's how I perform, then yeah, it's a byproduct. Um, but yeah. Uh, I'm happy. <laughs> you have a, a coaching staff that has, has been around the, you know, some of the elite athletes in the world, uh, you know, Valentin, Kendall. What do those coaches add to your preparation? You know, they're so inspirational and so highly technical. They know so much. Uh, they help me with technique and everything. I feel like uh, they're like a huge reason for um, how I perform and everything. Uh, and yeah, it's just so cool to be around them be able to wrestle where I do. Being at this tournament, it really feels like we're watching the future of women's wrestling, especially at the upperweights. You know, Karina and Kennedy Blades, you, Kylie Welker. What is it like to have come up with such an elite group of, of women? You know, it's so cool. I'm so excited to see how we do as a team. It would be really cool to be number one in the world as a team. We're always second or third, and I really feel like this year, is our chance to be number one. We have one of the strongest teams yet, and it's so cool to be uh, around these talented girls. Japan has perennially been the top team in the world. D do you think about Japan as, as an, a potential opponent? Do you, you know, do you have conversations with other girls that have made the team about, the, about Japan and, and specifically that opponent? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, like my whole wrestling, uh, you know, I always think about uh, wrestling Japan because uh, they're our number one enemy. They have like a, a really uh, good wrestling style. They're very fast. They always score at the end of the match when they're losing. So yeah, uh, on the team with the coaches, we always talk about how to wrestle Japan. Awesome. Well, I mean, I'm super excited to, to see that battle, Team USA, Team Japan, and just to see the, the, the group of women that uh, that's going to rep represent the USA. Um, congratulations. Do you have anything else before I let you go? Uh, I just want to thank all my coaches, uh, NYCRTC, Ted Mercury, everyone who's helped me get here, uh, my mom, you know, it's all thanks to you. Thank you so much. Awesome. Congratulations.